What's up guys, welcome back to Ify Chronicles. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can increase the amount of minted tokens that you're gonna be receiving for the airdrop. So number one, the amount of tokens of minted tokens that you're gonna be receiving is based entirely on the NFTs that you're holding. So if we go to their tweet, um, it says here that 30 million tokens will be distributed for the tier one up to tier six. So that is um, legit teams, lead codes, tier one backers so on and so forth so depending on the rarity of your nft you're going to be receiving a higher reward again it is 30 million tokens so it is divided by the amount of nfts that um, people are holding in total and depending on the nfts that you're holding that you, then you're going to be receiving a reward then also we have the first modular l2 which is 15 million tokens and you can get this one by combining all of these nfts so if you have all of them you can combine them to create this one and then you'll be able to get um, a portion of the 15 million mentor tokens this one is pretty good because there is less people holding this nft so most likely if you're holding one of these your reward should be a little bit smaller by the way there is no snapshot for the nfts you just need to be holding them so once the airdrop reclaiming process is ready you can use the nft to claim your reward next on the list is that there is a 5 million mentor tokens and out of that 4.2 is allocated for supporting stone and wusdm on some platform so let me go ahead and first start with the nft if you want to be holding different nfts what you can do is obviously first you can allocate a little bit more money so you can get um, more box pieces so once you reach 25 you'll be able to claim one box and that one box is an nft next on the list you can go to element.market and purchase an nft so right now you can see the prices for all of this again we don't know how much money we're going to be making from these nfts but we at least know how much um, is the price obviously the most expensive one is the lead codes which is around a thousand dollars yeah a thousand twenty eight then we have fixed high yields which is around two hundred dollars 217 and so on and so forth so if you want to purchase a few ones you do have the option to do so next on the list is using the platform so if you already allocated some money and you're holding maybe some stones maybe some wusdm you can stake it you will be earning some yields but at the same time you'll be earning a portion of the mentor tokens that will be distributed for this platform if you want to add your stone to your wallet so you can see it so that is by importing your stone you can do it just by clicking here add stone to wallet and we do add token so right there you guys can see that i have 0.1 stone currently and here it is perfect so from there you can use several platforms which they give you the option right here myself i am using layer bank and also shubio so let's go ahead and show you guys the process for layer bank and by the way shubio is actually the same process so since i have stone i just need to click on it right here first we will be supplying make sure that you're clicking available as collateral so you can also borrow against it and also earn some more points if you want to use looping which comes with a pretty high risk because it is basically supplying your funds um, borrowing against it then supplying it again then borrowing against it and repeating the process four times obviously you will earn some more points but again it comes with a really really high high risk which is um you might get liquidated i'm not even using it myself so i am unable to say um if it is recommended or not so we go ahead and do approve our transaction once that is confirmed um there we go let's go ahead and do max next approve and from there we will have the option to supply our funds once we're done we can also borrow against it so let me go ahead and supply first one second and also let me remove the sound confirm there we go and after a few seconds we should be able to then borrow against it 
There we go. Perfect. So I'm going to click on Save Max. I'm going to just remove some of these digits. We're going to do Borrow. And we should be good. Let's see. Confirm. There we go. And right there, the process is basically completed. We just need to wait until the airdrop is ready so we can claim from maybe Layer Bank. And also, as I mentioned before, we do have the option to use Shubio. What I do like about Shubio is that they are tokenless. So most likely by using this, we should receive a reward in the future whenever there is a token for this project. But just for me, I like to spread my funds um, between Layer Bank and also Shubio just to be safe. So let me show you guys the process. We would do Menta, Stone, and this is the website. So same process, you would come here, you click on Stone, you would do Max, Approve, you add your liquidity, and then you borrow against it if you wanna do it. And that's it, nothing, nothing else to do. I am already allocating some money. Um, as you can see, it says supply balance is at 0 0.18, so I am allocating $413, more or less. And that's it, as simple as that. So let me know if you have any questions, any doubts about how you will be claiming your funds, about the NFTs or anything else. But for now, I do think it is pretty easy to understand. So again, just quick summary, you'll be claiming your funds based on the NFTs that you have. You can go ahead and read the, the thread on Twitter on how the NFTs will be, I mean, the, the funds or the 50 million minted tokens will be distributed. And from there, you have the option to purchase a few more NFTs if you want to increase the amount of rewards that you're going to be receiving and also getting involved with Layer Bank or Shubio so you can also receive a portion of the 4.2 um, minted tokens allocated for this project. And that's it. Thank you guys for watching. Happy farming. Bye bye.